Many people are often run off the information superhighway when trying to understand terms like cyberspace, email, and the internet. But with the right help, it's easy to get back on. For example, the internet is actually the first information superhighway. Uh, the internet is, is a collection of, uh, of computers around the United States and around the world. Uh, there are educational institutions, business institutions, uh, commercial institutions. Uh, and, and in fact, what the internet allows us to do is to link all of those computers together. Now that wasn't so bad, was it? The internet has come on strong the last four years or so. The nice thing about the internet is its simplicity. You don't need a computer science degree to use it. So for instance, Eau Claire North, uh, Altoona, both of those, those schools, I believe they have uh, connections to the internet. Even some smaller schools, uh, there's a district up in, in Webster that is uh, connected to the internet. Before you run out and buy a computer, realize it takes a subscription to access the internet. But it is a valuable tool. Imagine you are in high school somewhere in Madison and you are considering going to UW-Eau Claire. Just take a ride on the virtual tour. A person can come to this virtual tour um, via the University of Wisconsin Eau Claire's homepage and uh, simply select an item of interest um, and when clicking on that it takes them to uh, usually an image uh, of uh, that item and then a brief description of departments and, and organizations located in that building. That saves a lot of gas money. In fact, anyone along the worldwide internet can access the same information along with business, sports and commercial information all at your fingertips. So don't be scared. Get on the highway. You won't believe where it will take you. In Eau Claire, Joel Nelson, New Center 13.